This demonstration will look at the question, how do I edit my video without disturbing the soundtrack? How do I mix up the video, move it around, and do funny stuff with it without changing my um, audio? Let's start with new. And I'm going to select multimedia 320 by 240 because I'm anticipating that I'm going to be outputting for YouTube. Go OK. First thing I do with every media project is I drag down a title so that I use up one of the tracks because you want the titles as near as I can tell you want the titles on a upper level of your uh, timeline. Now we go to explore and I'm going to drag down my media clip. Now if I try as I have to edit the video and audio of this track separate, separately, I have not found a trick for doing that. So the way I handle it is I drag down a second copy. The lower copy is going to be my audio track. The upper copy is going to be my video track. I find the audio on that upper video track and I mute it. It is now mute. Uh, we can verify that by let's drag this over so that we come down here toward the end. We'll play it. You can see the action and the sound is out of sync. That's because we've moved the visual part over just as a simple test. Now you'll notice what happens. Here there is no uh, obscuring video in the upper track. So if we come down here and play, so if there's a hole, the, it's as if the video is being shot from up above the final production. If there's a hole here, then what's below it is shown. Um, so to give you a, a clearer idea of that, I'm selecting this upper video. I'm going to press S to split. Now let's move this over. So now there's stuff here a gap and then stuff over here. So let's play this. That might have been too fast. Let's move this over. Okay. Then we put it back and there's no gap. you have the continuity. Um, therefore, what we have in the top is our video area. At the very bottom, we put a copy of our complete clip that we're working to that holds our sound. Or if you happen to have a sound file by itself, then that would go in the bottom. If you're going to make a music video, for example, where you're starting just with the sound. Uh, we'll look at that later. Okay, this gives us a little introduction to how to work with changing video and leaving the sound alone.